I think what's changed or you know, where we are in that cycle is that we have an opportunity uh, where there's more awareness, there, there's more people understanding that these issues and injustices are, are holding back not just the people that they directly oppress, but they're actually keeping all of us down. Alongside fighting COVID, we've also spent the past year acknowledging and fighting racism in our communities. One place we can turn to for solutions are our schools here in the city of Buffalo. Buffalo Commons Charter was the only school over the past year granted license to open by New York State. This fall, they plan to operate their entire school based on the concept of diversity and inclusion. Yeah, so I think when uh, people hear diversity inclu and inclusion, they automatically think just about race. But as we know, diversity can include a number of different um, categories, race, social, economical. Buffalo Commons is opening at this really interesting moment in time, right? We've seen a whole year of increased awareness on social and economic injustices and, and increasing racial tensions. Um, and we, you know, we're an intentionally integrated school and we're not just trying to bring people together for the sake of bringing people together to check any boxes. Um, but we want to be super meaningful and, and intentional about it. So we've really designed this curriculum and designed a school um, to help people learn about each other, learn about themselves, and with this idea that we're better together. If we can figure out how to get children thinking about that from as young as five years old, when they grow up and become adults, I think that will definitely have a great impact on the community in a positive way. How do you get to that next level, right? What if diversity meant something more than the color of our skin or uh, our gender identity or some of these things that are so visible? What if diversity was really thought about as this concept of like, who, who am I at my root and can I be that self everywhere? We are a diverse by design school, so we want to be intentionally integrated. We also uh, have a commitment to creative problem solving, developing students creative problem solving and collaborative and critical thinking skills. Um, and we really want to prepare students to not only be prepared for high school and college, but to lead successful and impactful lives as adults. I think the biggest problem that Buffalo Commons is trying to solve is really a reimagining of of how education works. So education has for a long time been focused on how can we give young people the skills that they need to be worthy of participation in our world, right? It comes from this idea that somehow young people lack something and it's the school's job to give it to them. And Buffalo Commons just turns that on its head. The whole idea of Buffalo Commons is how can a school help young people to discover where their unique talents are needed in the world, right? That they all have that something to give already and it's our job to figure out alongside them what it is and where it goes. In, in the years to come, we really hope to be an example um, in the city of Buffalo about what's possible um, when you have a commitment to diversity and to problem solving and to bringing people together across lines of difference.